What's up you guys? Let's learn how to change our guitar strings today. We're gonna need some strings and we're gonna need a tuner. And we're also gonna need a string winder and string cutter. I like to use this little D'Addario one right here. And we're not gonna do any setup. This will just be a quick string change. I like to keep tension on the neck at all times or as much as possible. So I start off by just loosening my first three strings. After I've loosened the tension, I can cut them here in the middle. Take my first half, wind it up so they don't get in the way. All right, we'll open up our pack here. I like to use NYXL 11s. Make sure to keep your bag so you can redeem your code. All right. String it through the back here. On the tally, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go two tuner lengths past where I'm going to be. So I'm gonna count past that one, two and then I'm gonna bend it here, make a bend, and then I'm gonna cut it right there. If I didn't have the telly style, if I had the string through style, then what I would do is I would pull this tight, grab it, pinch it at the nut, and then bring it back by one fret. And then that would give me enough slack here to wind it up around the tuning peg. For this instance, we're just gonna cut it where we bent it. Okay, and then we'll feed it through there. And I like to get this until it's about side by side here, so I can bend it to the right here, and then I just hold it in place as I wind. Now, I don't wanna tune it at this point. All I'm gonna do is I'm, I'm just gonna give it enough tension so that it doesn't lose its spot. We'll tune it here at the end. All right, let's do our next strings here. Again, we're gonna pull it tight. Check out where our tuning peg is. We're gonna go two past that. I'll bend it, and we'll cut it right there. Feed it in. Bring it to the side here, bend it down, and then I'll just hold it in place while I wind. Again, just bringing the tension up so that's secure at the nut and the bridge. Uh, we'll tune it here in a little bit. All right, again, we're gonna go two past, bend it. Awesome. Now that I got my first three on, I'm gonna loosen up my second three. Again, once the tension's gone, I can cut them here in the middle. Roll these up just to keep things clean. And I'll roll these ones up to keep them clean as well. Oh my gosh, this one doesn't wanna go through. There it is. All right, last two here. So now we've gotten to a point where we don't have another tuner to measure to. So we're just gonna kind of eyeball roughly where that would end up, bend it at that spot there. And then this one, I'm gonna bring it up to tension here. And then after I have a good amount of tension on it, like so, I'm gonna bend it underneath my string tree here and make sure some of them have like grooves underneath. So you just make sure it grabs under there, which this one did. And then we'll just kind of Awesome, bring that up to tension there. All right, last string here. And again, we're gonna pull it tight. We're just gonna eyeball one, two tuning heads lengths away and bend it there. Doesn't need to be exact, as long as it's kind of close, we're good. And again, we'll bring this up to tension. Now that it has a little bit of tension there, we'll go ahead and just bring it underneath our string tree. Make sure it grabs onto that little hook and then we'll bring it up a bit more. All right, so we've got all of our strings on here. Everything's nice and taut, but not in tune. So I've got my clip here that I'm gonna use, this Peterson strobe tuner. I really dig these strobe tuners because they're so accurate. And I'm just going to bring it up till I reach my note. It's important at this point that I only tune up. We don't want to try and tune down right now. We just want to stretch those strings out. So we're only tuning up. Now, after you tune them all up, you're going to give it a strum and it's still gonna sound kind of whack. This is what I like to do. Each one of these strings, I just take it and pull it. Just one by one. And now if I play it. 
Wow, we're way out. So we're gonna just retune it back up again. Again, we're only tuning up, okay? Because we're just trying to stretch these strings out. And sometimes it's okay if I go a little past. See how I went a little bit past E and we're kind of into the F zone? Again, I could just take this string, stretch it out, and I bet it's gonna go down. Wow, even past E, so. It's totally fine to use the stretching of your strings to tune down. Sounding pretty good. Let's stretch them one more time. Wow, we're getting pretty close. You'll know that your strings are ready for playing because you'll give them a stretch throughout it and it won't change the tuning terribly much. our strings have officially been restrung, stretched, and tuned. Let me know if you have any questions about this in the comments. Maybe I'll have to do like my strat next so that you can see how I do that little, that little one fret pushback thing. But yeah, let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Subscribe for more and I'll talk to you soon.